Hello everyone, this is Defense Politics Asia and quick update over at the Adyavka front. The Russian, force uh, Russian forces continue their offensive over at the Adyavka region with the fighting force uh, fighting reported south of Kayamka. They are moving south from Kayamka and also attacking towards Adyavka uh, from, uh, from the south. And um, there is also fighting reported uh, in the area of Povomaiske and uh, this is pretty normal. The fighting in the northern part uh, over at the Karamik uh, Nova, uh, Nova Kalinove region uh, did not happen. Uh, it, the front line remains to be quiet over there. Uh, so, however, we do have uh, Ukrainians attacking uh, the towards Opitne. They are attacking towards Opitne and attacking towards Vodian. And this, this operation, this attack seems to be uh, coordinated uh, along with the Ukrainian offensive that's happening over at the Balkan Nova Circle region, Donetsk region, and other any other region that was uh, that is currently having all these operations. The Russians force the Russian forces uh, were on the defensive uh, over at this region here. Uh, however, they managed to push back. They managed to push back the Ukrainians. So this this offensive uh, did not do much yet. Uh, but it does put the Russians on notice. Uh, the Russian, the Ukrainian Defense Ministry, however, did not acknowledge that there was a Russian offensive in this region, which is bizarre to me. Uh, while where else we can see pro-Ukrainian sources talking about the fighting, fighting in this region here. The Russians, however, continue their offensive and they continue to shell uh, Tonenke and uh, Lat Latoshkine. This is actually an important road because this is the so-called road of life for the ADFK region and uh, especially through Latoshkine. Uh, the one from Tonenke actually leads down to Vodian region. Uh, so that was it. Uh, Vodian and uh, Jivane region. So that's important in that sense. And then uh, this this road leads out all the way out of the region here. And you can see that based on the roads, there is some very limited amount of roads and all pins on Latoshkine. So, which is why the shelling at Tonenke and Lotoshkini is uh, rather significant at this area here. Uh, the road along uh, this uh, Natalnove you know, is no longer usable uh, tentatively uh, because the bridge was destroyed uh, by the Russian uh, strikes on the dam over at the Kalovsky res Reservoir. So anyway, this is the situation over at the Adyavka front with the Ukrainians uh, launching limited offensive over at this front line uh, in the area where the Russians are actually making their major offensive operations. So anyway, thank you for watching and uh, I'll see you in the next update.